Maria? This this was an unusual game in that Tennessee made a 21 to 9 run in, in the third quarter, and then you guys came back with a 15 to 9 run in the fourth quarter. Just what was the difference for Kentucky to close out that third quarter and then put it away in the fourth quarter? What what did you guys change up to bounce back? Um, well, it was just an intensity for us. Like we were trying to get the ball and we were trying to get the rebounds and push and push. So I think us pushing the ball and kind of like you know, and getting transition points was big for us. Um, the post did a great phenomenal job of, you know, boxing out and trying to get that pass and get the ball up early. So I feel like that was the main thing. We kind of like slipped, the, slipped away a little bit at the beginning of the third quarter, but we um, just turned it around when we came back out there. And it was just energy. Josh Sullivan. Uh, hi, Chaz. So uh, you start the game uh, at the two guard. Jasmine starts at the point. Um, how did this? How did you like this new look backcourt that you guys started with? Um, I definitely loved um, coming off the the two and having Jazz at the one. It was just a different look. The coaches said they were go they were gonna go with this game, and I feel like it was a great it was a great look for us. Um, I know that Jazz can push the ball as the one and, and get everybody open, and so just it was just me knocking down shots at that uh, at that guard spot, which just was, was big for me. So I feel like that was a good a good decision. Let's turn this. I know I can't hear him either. Okay. There we go. Zach. Hey, Jazz. Obviously, the Ole Miss game was a bit of a disappointment, but you've had the last seven days to prepare for this game. Mm -hmm. What have been the uh, key areas of focus and practice over the last week? Um, definitely boxing out, um, making sure we're pushing in transition and not putting too much pressure on uh, the half court. And so just pushing the transition and definitely boxing out, and just talking and bringing the intensity from from uh, the beginning of the game for 40 minutes. Um, I feel like that that's the game changer we had in this game. We, we were very intense the whole game. Had everybody locked in. Lee K. Howard. Yeah, with you playing more the two guard today, that obviously opened you up to, to scoring a little bit more. And when you see Ryan, who was affecting the game in a lot of ways, but not necessarily in scoring, did you kind of take it upon yourself that uh, you've got to you've got to uh, put some more uh, balls in the basket? I guess. Um, yeah, I definitely had a talk with Coach um, before the game, and she was telling me like, be aggressive, um, put your head down, and just go at them and score. And so that was my mindset coming into the game, playing the two, just going at them and being aggressive looking for my shots. And so um, Ryan definitely uh, did affect the games other ways besides scoring. And she, she had some big plays too. So that was big on, for her. And I was um, excited for her. Last question to John Wong. Chastity, given how Tennessee pretty much dominated you guys a couple of weeks ago, what does it mean for the team to be able to come back and win this? And what does it look like going forward now? Um, yeah, definitely. This is this was a good thing for us. Um, I guess um, we're coming into the game with intensity. Uh, I feel like practices has been more intense, and so we're just going to keep moving forward and keep working on things that we need to work on, which is uh, hanging our hats on defense and then pushing the transition and just, you know, looking up and trying to box out, stuff like that, just playing Kentucky basketball, really. So. Just a quick follow-up, if I could. You're you're known for being such a hard worker off the court. Uh, what's the one aspect of your game that you think you need to continue to work harder on as the year progresses? Um, for me, just um, making sure that um, I'm being a leader, um, being as a point guard, you know, being able to talk to my teammates, encourage them, and then just, you know, doing my role, which is, you know, score to help, help the team, um, bring intensity on both ends of the ball. <laughs> Thanks, everybody. Thank you, Chaz. Thank you.